Competing at the Olympic Games doesn't always go well. Sometimes athletes make mistakes, which end up costing them big time. In this video, we'll take a look at 10 of the most disturbing accidents throughout the Olympic Games. Number 10. The weightlifter who dislocated his elbow during the clean and jerk competition. American weightlifter Andranik Karapetin attempted to lift 195 kilograms or 429 pounds in the clean and jerk competition. He suffered a horrifying extended elbow that caused his arm to bend the wrong way and crumble under the weight of the bar. Karapetian, one of the favorites for the competition, was screaming in pain, with medics and trainers rushing to his aid before he walked off the stage cradling his injured arm. Number 9. The gymnast who landed on her head during her floor routine 17-year-old Ellie Downey was poised to make history at the Rio Olympics, but a shocking fall put that dream in jeopardy in the women's gymnastics qualifications round. Downey had gotten through the uneven bars and balance beam without incident, but at the halfway point of her floor routine, she tried to perform a flip with two and a half twists directly into a tucked front flip. She didn't have enough control to get her body completely around and landed directly on her head and neck. Number 8. The cyclist whose hip injury forced her retirement at age 25 Australian track cyclist Melissa Hoskins crashed and burned while training in Rio just three days before the action got underway in the Olympic velodrome. Hoskins' crash took out four of the five strong team pursuit squad. Hoskins has ended her career at age 25, saying, There is only so much pain she can handle. I want to finish on my own terms before I start to hate the sport, so I'm stepping away completely, she said. Number 7. A calf injury derails a rising badminton star from Malaysia. Ti Jingyi came to Rio prepared to give her best in what may have been her final Olympics, but it was not to be. A calf injury suffered midway through her first game against Japan's Aken Yamaguchi saw the Malaysian falling to defeat. She was leading the Group Keitai 17-15 when she grimaced in pain upon landing after hitting a shot. She asked for medical attention, which she received, but could hardly move in the second game as Yamaguchi pushed forward. Number 6. The equestrian who gave up her Olympic dreams for her sick horse Dutch equestrian Adelinde Cornelissen willingly gave up her Olympic dreams when her horse, Parzival, fell ill in his stall before he was due to compete. While visiting Parzival, Cornelissen noticed the right-hand side of his head was swollen and he'd been kicking the walls in his stall. She checked and, sure enough, Parzival was running a fever. When his temperature dropped and the swelling had subsided, vets and the team coach gave the horse the green light to compete. Number 5. The gymnast who completed a pommel horse event with a torn ACL German gymnast Andreas Toba suffered a torn ACL during qualifying for the men's floor event. Badly injured, he fell to the ground and immediately started crying as he thought his injury would cost his team a chance of progressing. But he didn't give up. Later that day, he completed his pommel horse event with the torn ligament so Germany could qualify for the next round. Number 4. The cyclist who took a tragic tumble during competition Dutch cyclist Anmiak van Vluten was leading the women's road race when she appeared to lose control on the descent, landing awkwardly on a roadside curb. Video footage showed van Vluten lying motionless on the ground, with paramedics surrounding her. She suffered three spinal fractures and concussion as a result of the crash, but has informed fans she's on the mend. Number 3. The Italian cyclist whose Olympic dreams were dashed after a collarbone break Another Olympic cyclist, another devastating fall. Vincenzo Nibali suffered a double collarbone fracture during the men's road race. He was one of the several high-profile riders to suffer injuries as a result of crashes during the competition. Nibali was flown to Italy for surgery. Number 2. The groom who was kicked in the head by a competing horse British groom Robbie Sanderson, a coach with the German dressage team, was injured during the team medal ceremony. As the medals were awarded, Sanderson was parading Sonki Rothberg's nine-year-old horse, Cosmo, when it reared up, caught him on the head, and knocked him to the ground. Blood gushed from his forehead as a replacement groom held Cosmo for the remainder of the ceremony. Number 1. Gymnast broke his leg while attempting to land a vault French gymnast Samir Eight Said was carried away on a stretcher after breaking his leg when landing a vault move at the Rio Olympics. The horrific vault accident left his leg dangling unnaturally. This all happened while attempting to land a vault on the very first day of the competition at the Rio Games, and then had to suffer the indignity of having his stretcher dropped when being placed into an ambulance. 